What's up, guys? It's Violet Tilly here, and welcome back to Let's Catch a Vibe. Now, I hope everyone's feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibey. As you guys can see, I'm doing the item shop switchover. This will take us from Friday night into early Saturday morning. Guys, I've been trying to upload this video for ages. I've had to get rid of loads of storage. It just wouldn't let me. Just wouldn't let me record. Wouldn't let me record the item shop. It kept saying, "Full of storage, full of storage, full of storage." I've had to delete tons of um footage on fortnite it's only been like when i've come like third and fourth and and sixth and stuff like that you know they've been really really good games but you know just the ending just the ending um but yeah i do apologize about that guys that the video is so late but as you guys can see we have the return of the customize your hero pretty much they are all legendary skins we have five female five male all come with their own little logo which you guys can see there all come with a legendary emote, which is pretty damn cool as well. So if we just go on to Joltara, they all come with the customizable skin. Various, various, various different selectable styles for this. Various different styles. You can have the mask on. You can have the, the um, well, the Dynamo mask doesn't really appear when you have it in that kind of mask. But if you can have it like that, you can, you, know, you can change the belt, no belt, all kinds of stuff. Really, really cool. Definitely recommend grabbing one of these guys because it is literally endless. You could literally customize whatever you want. Pretty cool that you can actually put any um, sticker you want on the chest as well. <laughs> like I can literally have somebody having um, burr, which is Rick's um, signature thing. But yeah, pretty damn cool. They all come with their own um, emoticon. Or they all come with their own um, legendary emote, the hero beacon. Caught me if I'm wrong, but I think this is the only legendary emote we have. I think I don't think we have many legendary emotes from what I'm my knowledge anyway. So this is this will be a first. Anyway, pretty much the same with the males as you guys can see. They all have their own little logo. But yeah, pretty cool. Moving us on to the hero gear bundle, pretty damn cool. So we can have a harvest and tool with three styles, as you guys can see now. We're going to have a multi cape where you can pretty much put any sticker you want on it as well. We have a holographic bat bling, my favorite, as you guys already know. Pretty much, you can have any um, emoticon or sorry, any kind of like sticker or banner icon or you know, whatever you want to have in this. We also get a blue cyclo emoticon and we also get a cupcake emoticon. Really, really cool. Definitely recommend grabbing this, guys. As you guys are seeing now, I have my own um, skin now. Pretty much modeled it off spawn. Well, more like a she spawn. But anyway, pretty damn cool. Moving us on to the items that you can buy singularly if you're only interested in buying them singularly. I was only originally going to buy the holographic bat bling, but I bought all of it because I thought, you know what? Why not? I had the V-Box at the time. Moving us on to the main featured store, which you guys are probably here for. We have the return of the Slingshot skin. Race to win. Part of the race that Royale set, first introduced in OG Season X. I think we had this skin recently, but she's got two styles. She's got the Slingshot, and then she's got the Mercury Racer, looking pretty damn cool in the all white. Moving us onto the Harvesting Tool, we have the Victory Lap. Give it a spin. Part of the race at Royale set, first introduced in OG Season 4. She does have two styles again, so we've got the Champion Victory Lap. And then we've got the Silver Streak Victory Lap, which looks pretty damn cool. Notice how you change the Champion um, plaque out for a racing flag, which is pretty damn cool. Moving us on from this, we had the return of the Hush Series Bundle. I call them, I call them series now because, you know... I just call them series. Anyway, we have the return of the Hush Bundle. Already done it is what is not worth it bundle video on this. Really, really strong skin. Definitely recommend grabbing it. Also, as I always say, it, whenever you buy this skin, or whenever you see this skin, watch the face, look at the eyes, look at the mask, and tell me that this is not um, the Slurpentine. Just look at the eyes, look at the mask, and tell me this isn't the Slurpentine skin. It's the Slurpentine skin. I want to know, and I want it confirmed by Fortnite themselves. If it ever happens, we'll never know. But yeah, pretty damn cool skin. Definitely recommend grabbing this. Does come with like a Halloween variant, which I think is pretty damn cool. So it's nice to know that you can actually buy a skin and get like another variant as well, especially one that you can use for another season. 
Anyway, moving us on to the return of the Chess Master Emote in the second half of the Featured Store. King Me. Synchronized Emote. First introduced in Chapter 3, Season 2. Literally during this season. Really, really cool Emote. Definitely recommend grabbing this. Moving us on to the return of the Big Chuggus. Slurp series skin. We have the big chuggus. Small chugguses need not apply. Looking pretty damn cool. The fact that he's got like slurp grenades as well, and he's pretty much made out of the top half of a slurp barrel. I like that. Moving us on to the return of the back bling, the juggus. Slurp juice not included. Looking pretty damn cool. I love the fact that when you wear this, same as with the chaos agent, it looks like you have like the um, liquid coming from the back bling into the mask, which is pretty damn cool. Obviously, it doesn't look like that when you turn to the side, but if you have it in like the middle, it looks pretty cool. Moving us on to the return of the double tap harvesting tool. Twin, sorry, twice the slurp in one powerful swing. <laughs> if you get with hit, hit with this, you may not die, but you're going to be severely knocked out. Anyway, part of the slurp squad set, first introduced in chapter two, season one. Last but not least, we have the slurp wrap. Not animated or reactive, but pretty damn cool. I like it. Very basic, but again, it's got that kind of like thing that I just like about it. But anyway, looking pretty damn cool on most of the weapons models. Looking really, really cool on Sniper. Loving that kind of like teal um, accent there on the metal. Anyway, moving us on to the return of the Sizzle Sergeant and the Grill Sergeant. We have the Sizzle Sergeant up first. She's cooking up a win. Part of the Der Burger set, first introduced in the OG Season X. Looking pretty cool. We've got the return of the Grill Sergeant. Make it sizzle. Part of the Der Burger set. First introduced in the OG Season 5. Pretty much thinking that Jonesy was undercover now. Finding out what was going on at the Der Burger. Maybe something was going on. Pretty cool though. Moving us on to the last but not least. We have the sizzling emote. Flip with flavour. First introduced in the OG Season 4. Hey! If I ever saw anyone else that flipped a burger like this for me, whoo, I'd pay top dollar for that burger just for the service. Jeez. Anyway, moving us on to the return of the Daily Store, which most of you guys are probably here for. We have the return of the Redux skin. Rebuilt, sorry, revived, rebuilt, ready for vengeance. Part of the Revenge Redux set, first introduced in what season? Chapter 2, Season 2, you already heard it out first, baby! Now, from what I'm thinking, Midas touched him. Pause, pause, pause. Midas touched his arms, basically. Probably to make them, like, a bit more stronger. But, yeah, pretty damn cool. Really, really like this skin. Definitely got that spy edge to it. it uh, hold on a bit. Looking in the face, it kind of looks like an alternate version of Jonesy. Looking in the face. I don't know. There's just something about it. It looks like Jonesy. Anyway, moving on to the return of the Barnic Relay. Stay connected in the heat of battle. Looking pretty damn cool there. We've got some grenades on there. We've got some extra shotgun shots. Really, really good in a fight. Moving us on to the return of the Envoy skin. Giving us some more um, spy skins. There is no such thing as second best. First introduced in Chapter 2, Season 2. Pretty much if you wanted like an X-Men... Um, the X-Men. I keep saying X-Men. <laughs> if you wanted a Men in Black inspired skin... This would be a really good skin for you. And can I just say, we like those, baby! Because if you guys, if you guys can see, she got those cheeks in those pants. Love the knee-high boots as well. Looking really, really cool. Mwah. 10 out of 10. Anyway, moving us on to the Daily Day store. As you guys can see, we have the return of some emotes and a harvester tool. So, we have the angular axe. Abs sorry, accurately obtuse. Part of the counter attack set, first introduced in the OG season six. Are we getting the counter attack counter attack skin back coming soon? <clears throat> anyway, moving us onto the E month, we're the return of the pop lock. Lock it down. First introduced in the OG season four. Jeez. Uh, 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 hey. What? What? Wait. Moving us onto the return of the flux. Stay in flow. First season OG season seven. Last but not least, we have the very sneaky traversal emote. One of my personal favourites. Stealth mode engaged. First introduced in OG season X. Jeez, 
Last but not least, we have the return of the remaining bundles, which we have had would will have had in the item shop over the past week or more. We have the Omega Knight level up quest. We have the Allié bundle, Icon Series Legend. Absolutely love this skin. Really, really happy that it's come to the game because it's about damn time. Anyway, moving us on to the return of the Robo Cup bundle. We have the Master Chief bundle. We have the Kata Marcus bundle. We have the Emergent Gear bundle. And last but not least, we have these special offers and bundles. But yeah, guys, sorry about the item shop being super, super late. Literally just had, really, had, really had to get rid of loads and loads and loads of footage. Had to pretty much gut my hard drive pretty much for Fortnite. But yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, don't forget to smash that like button. If you didn't like the video, let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like the video. Also, are you interested in getting one of these legendary superhero skins? and making your um, skin locker um, absolutely infinite. But anyway, guys, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new and join Team Let's Catch a Vibe. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to switch on the bell notifications to get notified as soon as I upload. But more importantly, don't forget to stay the vibe and I'll catch you all in the loop. Peace.